I were a superhero, I mean, to make it simple, I guess the name would just be um, the net dude. <laughs> I would only have two powers. One would be to rewind time to the moment when a record executive decided they could charge twice as much for a CD as an LP and tell them, no, don't do it. And then the other power would be, and I actually think about this a lot, if I had some kind of giant city-sized net that I could pull through and only the records would like somehow pass through walls and come up from basements and all the other fish swim out but just the records stay in the net, that would be amazing. My outfit would be, I don't know, maybe something kind of like um, a Cylon, like from the original Battlestar Galactica. My headquarters would be probably Trenton, New Jersey. I would be a baseball scout. So if I had a day job, yeah, that'd be cool to be able to go around to different ballparks and, um, and just try to scout the, the next generation. Um, my arch nemesis in all of this, well, it's, it's kind of ironic given, you know, my superhero power, but it would be anybody who thinks that quantity in a collection matters more than refinement of the collection. My vehicle would be the first car that I owned, which was a 1977 Cadillac Sedan DeVille. And it was one of those cars that it only broke down right outside of home. I could drive for, you know, eight hours and it would overheat, like, within walking distance of the outskirts of the town I grew up in. So, as my dad always used to say, any car that does that, you hang on to. I'm DJ Shadow, and I guess my uh, alias for the purposes of superhero um, exploits would be the net dude. <laughs>